Hello. Ah, I'm going to sleep. Nah. All right. What we're really doing for this video is going to be reviewing some of the new Taco Bell items. Okay. So there's a few items. This is the Nacho Crunch Taco, which I've heard is phenomenal. We got the grilled cheese burrito box and also the pineapple with freeze. I don't know what to think of it yet, but we'll see. So I got the the box comes with the, the cinnamon twists, which are really good. Cool to have them with the box, I guess. I mean, if you don't like them, I mean, that's up to you. You could probably just order the burrito separate. And it also comes with a just a beef crunchy taco, regular kind of stuff. You know, if you've been there, you probably had a crunchy taco from there, maybe. If you haven't, still, you can try it. This burrito is really cheesy. Like, I open it up, and there's already some cheese on the side. It's, like, melted a little bit. But we're going to give that a go. Take a quick bite. Let you know what I think. right away the cheese the beef it just kind of melts in your mouth a little bit let me try some more it's not like there's an insane amount of sauce all right there's not but you know it's still got cheese it's still got a little bit of sauce I think and the melted cheese kind of goes good with the little bit of rice because it kind of holds it together a little bit but it also gives you just a compliment to your beef and beef and cheese goes really well so far pretty good I think got a little bit of kick if you like a little bit of spice it's probably pretty good for you if you like a lot of spice it's probably not that spicy but you get the idea for fast food it's, it's kind of spicy if I had to rate this grilled cheese burrito, I would give it an 8. Just right now. Maybe it's a little greasy. And, you know, I guess some melted cheese on the side, which is kind of weird. See that? I hope you can see it. But anyway, I'll give it an 8. The deal with the drink, $5 is a pretty good deal. Alright. This is the freeze. I need to wash down this because it's a little bit, a little bit spicy. But also, you gotta have a little drink. No, they ask for whip or no whip. I don't even know. I'm not sure what without whip would be like, but it's like a little bit melted. You can see at the bottom, there's just a little bit of liquid, but still a freeze. Still smooth, good flavor. I can taste the pineapple, but it's not too much, and it's not something I distaste right away I think it's really good I mean I really love the Baja Blast Freeze but if I was looking for something new or maybe just didn't want the caffeine that's in that beverage this would be great overall I'll probably give it a 9 or 10 honestly it's really good I mean it was a, it was a little bit but I think the Baja Blast Freeze is a similar price, and you can get it at the, I think it's 2 to 5 o'clock is the happy hour, is what it said on the sign when I was there. So if you go at that time, it's an even better deal. And last but not least, the Nacho Crunch Taco. Now I've been hearing a lot. It looks like the Cheesy Gordita Crunch. You have the, the hard shell and the soft shell on the inside and out. There's two shells, a little bit of cheese kind of melted in there and it's got a little bit of the, the crunch at the bottom with the Fritos but you can see the melted cheese in here I hope you can see that holds it together let's give it a go it tastes a lot like some of the other stuff like the the burrito or the tacos you can get from there 
but the crunch is a nice compliment and the cheese kind of gives you that melted cheese burrito kind of thing you, you would get with the cheese burrito or something else with the melted cheese I do like it I'm not really good at <laughs> rating food with good culinary terms and saying the right things but I'll tell you what I think of it I think it's pretty good also I think it's only a dollar they might have changed it now but I think it's actually cheaper than like just a regular crunchy taco or soft taco which is crazy to me but I mean who am I to argue man this is really good Mm. the crunch just pops okay it just pops out of your mouth I haven't even finished chewing but I still want to talk to you because it's popping pops out of your mouth you get the nice soft beef and cheese and lettuce and then you get the soft shell with, then you complement with the crunchy I think the Fritos and the crunchy shell it's a really good combination overall I'll give this a 9 as well. Maybe not perfect. And I don't know. It, it seems like really good though. And maybe not everyone likes the crunch. But I think it's really, really good. I'll give it a 9. Would definitely order again. I didn't even put sauce on. But if you put the sauce on, I think it would be even better. So I'm going to try a little bit with some sauce. With a little fire sauce you don't have to use fire sauce you can have some other sauce if you like more mild or just the hot one a lot of people will tell you that the fire sauce isn't all that hot but they're mainly spicy food eaters and I'm kind of one of those someone who enjoys spicy food That is even better because it gives you that extra kick. That kind of spice and the sauce. I think it's really, really good. Would definitely recommend. All of these would recommend. I'll give them the burritos probably eight or nine. I'll give this a nine. The freeze, I'll give it a nine. Maybe someone doesn't like pineapple. I don't know. Anyway, we'd love to know what you think. Or if you have any new suggestions, I will get the stuff that's been recommended in the past. Just give me some time. Hope you enjoy. Peace out. Have a great day.